Now there's a massive, massive buzz around regarding this film. Without giving too much away, could you just give us a little bit of a, a synopsis of what the, the, this film is about? Well, um, it's about uh, a person whose name is Aina. And uh, he's a um, small town actor who wants to make, uh, who came to Dhaka to make big. But uh, over the course of time, he was faced with life-threatening challenges and he had to uh, undertake uh, various characters under his lairs. And, and he was challenged by the day-to-day -day life crisis. And this is how it, the, it, it goes on and it reveals something else, which is uh, uh, the way the script and the screenplay and the sequence have been laid out. You don't realize that you've just passed uh, 144 minutes. Wow. Okay. So, look, this has been massive in Bangladesh. I mean, I think we were speaking earlier about, you know, there were Hollywood films that had to be taken down in the cinemas to, yes. to, air, this, to air this movie. Yeah. Um, it's been showcased in Paris and Australia, Canada, yeah. um, and it's just come to the UK. Yes. Um, and is it right, it's been 30 years since uh, a, a Bengali film has come to the UK? Yes. How comes it's taken so long? And well, <coughs> uh, um, basically, um, to have a film internationally premiered or screened, you have to fulfill a lot of criteria, and that's where uh, that's where the standards, that's where the directors' directions come into play, the producers, and the quality of the films comes into play. And over the course of time, uh, the Bangladeshi film industry and the private sector, who uh, the uh, the producers of Aina Bhaji, um, uh, they have spent their time, money, and the energy to make this such a wonderful film, which kind of ticks all the boxes of a good film. That's why it's been screened uh, all over the major cities of the major countries, and now it's here in the United Kingdom. And what has been the 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 UK audience's response to this film? I mean, uh, when you are good, you're good. And Aina Bhaji is a, such a wonderful film. And uh, thank you to um, Aina Bhaji supporters and the fans who kind of, uh, because we had our first uh, screening yesterday and it was house full. And uh, I would like to take this opportunity to thank everyone who came to watch Aina Bhaji, supported Aina Bhaji, and uh, there'll be more people coming into the, we are full house today as well. There are some options on Monday. But uh, thank you to all the viewers who came to enjoy Anavaji and who are coming to enjoy Anavaji. And in regards to to the film, just watching the trailer, you can see it's it's very. You can compare it to a bit to Hollywood, I would say. You know, the the cinematography yes. is fantastic. <coughs> yeah. Um, what would you say was the main difference? Because I think when I've been reading reviews of this film, mm -hmm. everyone is saying how different it is from other Bengali yes. films. I mean, uh, I mean, the trailer itself kind of speaks uh, very highly about the way the uh, production and the directors uh, use the uh, high standard of uh, cameras to bring out the true color of Dhaka. And also the opening scene of the trailer, you will see this is the first time Bangladesh in film industry and in film they use drone. Yeah. So, and I think it says it all. It, it nails it basically. And um, uh, from there on, um, you need to consider um, the camera, lighting. I mean the sound, uh, 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 Dolby sound. So every element of a good filmmaking drama has been utilized to its fullest extent so that it's it's the best. Yeah. Um, and is it right that this film um, is being celebrated um, in Cannes Film yes. Festival? Yes. What, what other, you know, what recognition has it had? I mean, it is, so it, it, it is claiming, um, it is claiming a lot of international um, accreditation, I would say. And um, because of the, uh, the story, the way this has been written, and because of the direction, Amitav Reza, the way it's been directed, mm. and because the producer's been, been patient, and I mean, uh, to make a good film, you don't need a good budget. What you need is a good story. Mm. And the story, as you know, it's very catchy, but also you need to have that dedication, and, and, and you have to have 
experience behind you to back that and have a, a tight budget so that you can execute a good movie. Yeah, and the um, actors in the film as well, they've also been, you know, they've been critically acclaimed for, yes. for their performance as yes. well. Um, are, are you finding that this film is creating a, a buzz amongst young, younger actors as well and uh, aspiring actors? It is, um, uh, I mean, it is, it's a, uh, thank you for this lovely question actually. The actor and actresses, the, even the side actor and actresses, Everybody has experience behind their back. I mean, uh, Chanchal. I mean, it goes without saying. Yeah. Um, I mean, the the other other major actor and actresses. They all have uh, acting background, acting experiences, anchoring experiences. Coming to the younger generation, I mean, the uh, our my, my ethos of bringing Anavaji to UK uh, is to actually connect our current generation and the future generation of the, our wider community where children can be inspired and say, hey, I can choose a career and I can become a director and I can make a film like this because we go to watch Hollywood and Bollywood movie in cinemas and now there is a new avenue opened where ch future generation can think, hey.